In this video, we'll show the steps required to build a basic configuration file that connects Maple MBSE to your Teamwork Cloud model. We'll cover installing the Maple MBSE editor, creating a basic Maple MBSE configuration file, editing the systems model, both in Maple MBSC and in Cameo Systems Modeler, and finally, creating a simple Maple MBSC template. We'll start by opening a development environment of our choice, in this case, Eclipse. We'll then install the Maple MBSC editor, which can be found separately along with your Maple MBSC installation. We'll create a new project and drag in the sample Maple MBSC Teamwork Cloud applications. Now we're ready to create a simple configuration file for the Teamwork Cloud sample application. A Maple MBSC configuration file maps model information from diagram-based model form into a table-based form. It consists of a variety of sections that are all necessary, and we'll go through them now. The first thing we'll do in our configuration file is insert the import ecore commands, which are the meta model definitions that define the type of model elements that we'll use in the application. In the Teamwork Cloud sample configuration file, you'll find the ecore commands, which you can copy and paste into your own configuration file. We'll use the no magic ecore since we're using magic draw, and then we'll use the Maple MBSC ecore and give it an alias, in this case MSE, so we can reference it easier. In our next section, we'll provide Maple MBSC a data source, which helps tell Maple MBSC which model element specifically that it has to point to. When defining how to access a model in Maple MBSC, we always start with the root model as a way to address the main model. In our second line, we're telling Maple MBSC to display all the packages within this model. In the sync table schema section, we're defining the information we'd like from the model, defining what attributes of the package to see in Maple MBSC. We'll name the sync table schema package schema. When using the dimension command, the first dimension corresponds to the package, the second would correspond to the next level and hierarchical method. Every dimension should have at least one key column. It's a unique entry for Maple MBSC that is used to access the package. It could be a name or an ID, but it is required. In this section, you can define other columns as well. The visibility attribute is often a required entry for Teamwork Cloud package elements, so we'll use this one as one of the fields to display in our Maple MBSC worksheet. In this next line, we'll have to now describe from which part of the model we get the package. We're referencing the root model PKG. The worksheet template section describes how to represent the information in a table consisting of columns and rows. Maple MBSC supports three kinds of Excel views, vertical tables, horizontal tables, or matrix view. We'll use the vertical table representation and specify the row and column where the sync table starts. The key field area references the key column that we described earlier. We'll then add another attribute field, package visibility, which we described above. Lastly, we have to provide a workbook template which specifies how to organize the worksheets that were created earlier. So in this case, we just have the one. We've now got a simple configuration file that will allow us to access our Teamwork Cloud model within a Maple MBSC worksheet. We'll now click on Open Teamwork Cloud Model, and we'll log into Teamwork Cloud. You can see from this simple example that Maple MBC has loaded in the basic information from the Teamwork Cloud model. This is the same information contained within the Teamwork Cloud model, so you can also access it with Magic Draw. If you add a new entry within Maple MBSC and commit those changes to Teamwork Cloud, they'll be updated within the Teamwork Cloud model and can be viewed within Magic Draw. Information you edit within Magic Draw can also be saved and viewed within Maple MBSE. You can take advantage of the formatting capabilities of Microsoft Excel 
to create a template for your Maple MBSC worksheet. Here, we'll simply add column headers, name, and visibility. If you click on Export to Excel Worksheet and save it with the same file name as your Maple MBSD MSC file, the file will act as a template for that Maple MBSC worksheet. This example showed how to create a basic configuration file for Maple MBSC and Teamwork Cloud models. For more information on using Maple MBSC, visit maplembsc.com.